Hey folks, we are answering frequently asked questions from the Okta Customer Identity Cloud community. Today, we will discuss how to enable multi-factor authentication for a subset of users. By default, once MFA is enabled, it applies to all users in the tenant. In the video, we will use an action to enable MFA for a subset of users. Ensure the tenant has the required multi-factor authentication set to never. This is located in the dashboard under Security and Multi-Factor Auth. The subset of users that require MFA will need to have the user metadata Use MFA attribute set to true. This can be updated using the dashboard or the Auth0 management API. If using the dashboard, go to User Management and Users. Select the user. Scroll down to User Metadata and use an attribute with a Boolean value. For example, use MFA set to true and save the changes. If using the Auth0 Management API, we will need the ID of the user to update. This is found on the User Management User Details tab. Paste in the user ID and in the body add the User Metadata object and use an attribute with a Boolean value. For example, use MFA set to true. Test the endpoint and confirm the 200 response code is received. Now, we need to create the login flow under Actions. The YouTube description provides an example code. The action looks for users with the attribute set and will require the MFA challenge when that user attempts to log in. Let's log in as our test user, who does not require MFA. We can see that we have not been prompted for an MFA challenge. Now when we log in as our test4 user that had the metadata updated, we will be prompted for the MFA challenge. That's it. You have successfully enabled MFA for a subset of users. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to us on YouTube and join us for more content on community.auth0.com.